Welcome back to the channel, guys. Haven't seen y'all in a while. My name's Kevin. This is Blue Collar Bearded, back with another review for you guys of a stellar, stellar company that I keep in my inventory on a regular. Yeah. Well, we're back. Took a couple weeks off. Got the beard a little trimmed up again. Had to do some fine tuning. And I happened to get my hands on not one bombshell, two from none other than Florida Boys Grooming. Yeah, got Molan Labi. This was January's scent of the month that he released. And let me tell you what, you guys, if you missed this, boom is all I can say. Oh, did I forget to tell y'all? Yeah, got another one to review today. Pow, Midnight Cowboy. I've been waiting on this one since last year. Matt said, you know, when I made Burning Daylight, I didn't think I could ever top it. Well, little brother, you did. You topped it. Midnight Cowboy. We're going to get into some scent descriptions now. You guys know I've been doing a couple of reviews for Matt here and there. And this one is no exception. Let me tell you, I loved both of these. You know, Matt's blends 50% emu, sunflower oil, rosehip, avocado, argan, jojoba, sweet almond, vitamin E, fragrance oils, and essentials. Now... Let's get into some fragrance descriptions. Molan Labi. Check that label out, man. Matt is just, he's got the right guy on top of this. Man, this artwork is stunning. Switched over from dropper tops. And he's got some restrictor tops now, which I am super, super pleased with that. Always does quality bottles, quality labeling. Now, Molan Labi is a special one. If anybody knows what that means, it means come and take it. Well, good luck prying my cold dead hands off of Molan Labi. <laughs> All right, guys. Birch, pink peppercorn, citrus medley, saffron, guac wood, amber, cashmere wood. Yeah. Sexy, let me tell you, pow, cedarwood, agarwood, and tonka bean. This profile opens up so nice, guys. Just right out of the bottle, you get that birch, a little bit of birch. The peppercorn is there, but it's more of on a subdued level. It's like a nice binding scent. The saffron in the cashmere woods shines through really well. And when I wore this on the dry down, that agar wood and tonka bean, the a little bit of the cashmere and the cedar showed through really, really well on the dry down. And Matt's, Matt's oils are always, always top quality. I mean, I never have a problem with them ever breaking me out or anything like that. He always uses good quality skin safe fragrance oils and i happened to get this time around he made it an option for you to get oil and colognes because he knows i'm not much of a butter guy but he is one of the butters that i do use from time to time but check out that cologne label molan labie this is nice man super freaking sweet anyhow that was item number one let's get on to fragrance number two Midnight Cowboy. Black bottle. Look at that. Beautiful. Just beautiful artwork. Matt's always on top of his game. Pow. Spares no expense when it comes to the labeling. It's got the ingredients list on there. Yes, it does have a warning for nut carriers. The profile's on there. Matt's always on top. Can't beat it. Guys, can't beat it. The Midnight Cowboy. Lovely label. 
digging it, guys. I'm telling you. Let's get into this profile real quick. Midnight Cowboy. Tobacco Vanilla. Saffron. Texas Cedar. And Old Spice Cologne. Damn. That's all I can say about that. Boom. He did it again. Man, I smell all of it. All four of these fragrances in these in this oil is just between the oil and the cologne, you put these on, it's loud. <laughs> it's gonna wake up the dead, y'all. I'm telling you, this is good. Man, that midnight cowboy, tobacco vanilla, saffron, Texas cedar, old spice. Man, beautifully crafted, Matt. Beautifully, beautifully crafted. And this is unbelievably good. Wow. This one, if you know, Matt's father passed away last year. And Midnight Cowboy is the second, the second tribute sent to his dad. Dad, I couldn't be more proud to be a part of being able to release this review to you guys, be the first one to get my hands on it. I thought Burning Daylight was the top dog. I think Burning Daylight just got shown up right here. Midnight Cowboy, guys. Get you some. Releases February 1st. Might even release early. Don't know yet. We'll see. That's all I got for you guys today. If you're new... Hit that subscribe button, like the video, share the video, get it out there. Let everybody know Midnight Cowboy releases February 1st, fellas, February 1st. Keep her shiny side up, and I'll catch you guys in another week or two. Blue Collar out.